Hello everyone, welcome to our SOLIDWORKS simulation channel. In today's lesson, we will perform static analysis of a leaf spring assembly. In order to determine its stresses, deformations, factor of safety. First of all, understand the boundary conditions being applied on this leaf spring. Uh, this leaf spring is fixed at the bottom of this face and the load of 3000 Newton is applied on its two top faces on this face and on the this face. Also, cylindrical faces of all leaf springs are fixed. So, you have to apply a fixed boundary conditions for all these cylindrical faces. And another constraint is that we have to apply a translation fixed boundary condition in the z directions. That means that, that there is no movement in the z direction or normal to the screen. So first of all download this leaf spring assembly from our video description link. After that go to simulation and start a new simulation study. Name it leaf sorry name it leaf spring analysis leaf spring analysis this leaf spring is made of elastic steel material so on parts right click and apply material to all please subscribe our channel so here is elastic apply close so if we expand the parts you can see the elastic material has been applied on all number of springs and next step is to define the interactions component interactions the component interaction between all these leaf springs is contact type. So, expand the component interaction, right click and add a definition and from the interaction type select contact type. Ok. And now it's time to create or apply the fixtures. First of all, we will apply the fixed geometry condition on its bottom. And after that, again apply fixed geometry fixture on all the circular pieces of the hole. So select all these. Ensure that all these have been selected. Now you will apply the translational boundary conditions. So in order to apply the translational boundary condition, again go to fixtures, select the fixed geometry and from here select advanced options and use reference geometry. Then select all these pieces. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And here is the reference geometry. Click on here and select the front plane as a reference. Now apply the translation in the z directions. In this z direction, that there is a no movement in the z directions. So you can see the translation has been applied. We can change the symbol color as well as symbol size. Okay, so 
three types of mounting conditions has been applied on this leaf spring assembly and it's time to apply the force of 3000 newton on this face and this face this force is normal to the these faces and select the total option total force is 3000 newton after that you will create a curvature based mesh create mesh and from the mesh parameters select the curvature based mesh leave the other parameters default please wait as mesh is being generated give your comments if you have any queries so curvature based mesh has been generated it's time to run our simulation study to run this study now and wait until your solution converge so simulation has been completed now now it's time to check the results that are stresses deformations as well as factor of safety right click on the stress we will check the one measure stresses values change units to megapascal and floating so you can see the maximum value of stress is 321.8 megapascal that is less than that of the heat strength so if we check the factor of safety right click on the results and define factor of safety and from theory select the maximum one major stress theory ok so minimum factor of safety is 1.9 you can see here that means your leaf spring assembly is safe under this prescribed load of 3000 newton and then the last you will check the deformation so maximum deformation is 13.7 millimeter that occurred at the tip at the ends of this leaf spring you can see the deformation behavior of this leaf spring assembly and please note that there is no deformation in the directions if you check the deformation in the z direction go to the define displacement plot and check the deformation in the z direction is almost negligible 0.009 so i think you enjoyed this tutorial please subscribe and share this video and subscribe our channel thank you for your time take care bye bye